Sports with Pete Byrne. Tomorrow night, number eight Notre Dame will host number four Duke with a chance to legitimize their claim at the ACC title. It will be the biggest game in terms of ranking that Purcell Pavilion has seen in more than a decade. WSBT 22's Carl Deffenbaugh takes a closer look. In a season already full of unreal plays and unbelievable finishes, eighth-ranked Notre Dame is hoping the greatest moments are yet to come. Wednesday is a great opportunity, you know, playing against Duke. You know, my first time playing against them. You know, I know a couple guys on the team, so to get a win against Coach K and Duke would be exciting. At 19 and two, the Irish are off to their best start in four decades, with number four Duke coming to town. The Blue Devils are the gold standard in the ACC. ND's victory last year was a rare bright spot in a lost season. A win on Wednesday would cement the Irish as a front runner in their new league. These are games you watch growing up on TV, so I'm just excited to be a part of it. Beating Duke, you know, those are things that make you feel like you belong in this league and you're not a stepchild anymore. You're in for real. Duke's Mike Shashevsky claimed career win number 1,000 on Sunday, 216 of which and two national championships came in the eight seasons Mike Bray spent on his staff from 1988 through 1995. And Bray remains the only former Coach K assistant to ever beat the legend. Certainly an unbelievable achievement. I'm honored that uh, I was a small part of that way back when I was a younger man and wore a tie and had more hair. This year's squad has a swagger and confidence born from success. And they're ready for the first top 10 matchup at Purcell Pavilion since 2003. I think it's going to be a circus anyways because it's a great matchup and I, I think our fans are going to be through the roof. I expect it to be even crazier than last year. Um, granted, both teams are ranked you know, pretty high. But um, I know our guys are really excited. We just need to continue to prepare ourselves for the game. Carl Deffenbaugh, WSBT 22 Sports. The Irish and Blue Devils tip off at 7.30 tomorrow night.